Hey guys, this is Ben with Joe's Gaming and Electronics, here with another video on the 3DR Solo. This tutorial is going to show you how to change the leg magnetometer, also known as the uh, external compass in the 3DR. Now if you're constantly seeing that anywhere that you take the drone, you have this constant magnetic interference error, it is most likely a defective leg magnetometer, but you can also go ahead and first try recalibrating the compass and seeing if that helps. If that doesn't help, this should be your way to fix this. So let's get started. First, you wanna make sure the drone is powered off. This one is powered off, so I will go ahead and remove the battery. Next, you'll wanna take off this top cover. So just squeeze together right here at the sides and push this forward and it should just pop out. Take that and put it to the side. And now we'll wanna get all of these screws out. All right, after you've loosened all seven of these screws, we can lift up this battery tray, or try to. I haven't quite gotten all of these loose. There we go. And lift it, pull it around these battery terminals, and be careful not to tear this wire. Go ahead and unclip this from the board, and we'll set that aside. Now, looking at the main board, we have a lot of things going on, a lot of ribbons, a lot of connections, but what we want is right back here. This is on the side with motor pod number four. And we wanna undo this clip right here. That's what's connecting the leg compass. So that clip is right behind where we wanna get to. So can't quite fit your finger in there, try and get a pry tool, something small and thin so that you can press on that clip and just pull it right out, just like that. Now that we have it dangling, we can just let it sit there. All right, now go ahead and flip it over. This is gonna be the leg we wanna work with, so start by removing a, the rubber foot if you have that on there. And then there's also this screw right there holding the external compass in place. So go ahead and get that off. All right, now that that's out, we can go ahead and get this compass out. All right, now that we've removed this external compass from the leg, we want to get the actual leg off so we can get it out of the drone. So it's just going to be these two screws right here. Okay, now we can pull it up and out of the drone. And then just pull the external compass out and bring out that clip. Now we can set this defective one aside and grab our new one. Now this one, we'll just wanna feed that clip back in there. Make sure you can see where it is coming out of. So at the same time, you can go ahead and try to clip it in right now. It's a little bit tricky, but if you can just get your fingers right there and just clip it right in place, just like that. Now we'll go back to this side and we wanna put the leg back on, so let's feed this wire into the leg and make sure that this screw hole lines up with the one on the leg. So we'll just push that up just enough to get it to line up. Just like that. And now make sure you feed the wire back into the body of the drone and tighten these two screws back on for the leg. Now we'll get the rubber foot and, or not quite yet, we need to make sure we get this screw back on. 
So go ahead and put that back in place. Right, and then we can put the rubber foot back over. There you go. Now, the hard part's done. We just need to put the battery tray back on. So, go ahead and put that clip back in place. Press it in. Listen for that click. And then slide this battery tray over the terminals. You can tug up on these terminals a little bit if it's not sitting flush. There might also be a wire in the way or something. You can look out for that. All right, there we go. Now we just wanna tighten all these screws back in. All right, now we can take the plastic cover, slide it back over the GPS. And you should be good to go. Now you can go ahead and pair it with the controller, run another calibration, and that should fix your issue. All right guys, if you have any questions regarding this tutorial, be sure to leave a comment below. If you like the video, please leave it a like. Subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching, and as always, have a fantastic day.